Hello viewers, we have a great news for you all. IPC is going to launch New Indian Pharmacopoeia which will be Indian Pharmacopoeia 2022. They are organizing IPC conference 2022 which will be addressing medicine quality for future on July 1st, 2022 New Delhi. In this conference, they will be highlighting the release of Indian Pharmacopoeia 2022 by Honorable Health Minister. Who can attend it? Pharmaceutical leadership, R&D scientists, quality control analysts, regulatory affair professionals, analytical CROs, researchers and academicians. Everybody can attend it. They are saying block your dates. Registrations will be opening very soon. And special discount will be available on purchase of IP 2022 by the registered participants. So after this, I will be telling you some of the important salient features of IP 2022. So this is Indian Pharmacopoeia 2022. We all know that it is published by Indian Pharmacopoeia Commission which is Ministry of Health and Family Welfare, Government of India. Then its website is www.ipc.gov.in and the effective date will be 1st December 2022 as they have given till date. And the important features of this IP, new monographs 92 have been included, 27 APIs have been included, then dosage Forms or chemicals included are 33, then vitamins, minerals, amino acids, fatty acids, etc. are 21, biotechnology derived therapeutic products are 3, then herbs and herbal products included are 2, blood and blood related products are 2, then vaccines and immunosera for human use included are 4 and general chapters are 12. So these are the important chemicals which have been added. Then these are the vitamins which are included. Then the two important herbs and herbal products are chitrak and series. This is important. You should note it down. Then these are four important vaccines and immunosera for human use. Then blood related products. Two products are included. And TD blend that is IgM and IgG monoclonal reagents and anti D IgG monoclonal reagents. Then three biotech derived therapeutic products have been included. Then these are some of the general chapters which have been included. So you can see few upgradations in it like rounding rules for calculation of results. Then these are some of the general chapters. Then general monographs of capsules, inhalation preparations, parental preparations are included. Then these are chemical monographs which have been included. These are vitamins, minerals, amino acids, fatty acids. Then these are phytopharmaceuticals. Then herbs and herbal products. The vaccines and immunosera for human use general requirements then monographs then blood and blood related products biotech derived therapeutic products then allergen products veterinary monographs then there are some of the change of titles like in general chapters from 2.4.42 inductively coupled plasma mass spectrometry to 2.4.42 Inductively coupled plasma spectrometry. Here mass word is removed. Then in second you can see 2.8.2 assay of human anti-D immunoglobulin method A. to they have changed to 2.8.2 assay of human anti-D immunoglobulin. Here method A has been removed. Then in the case of monographs. Dextron 14 injection has been changed to 14 fusion and here also Dextron 17 injection have been changed to infusion and here sodium starch glycolate will be now known as sodium starch glycolate type A. This is some monograph rearrangement under new categories. 
like from chemical category they have shifted it to vitamins minerals amino acids fatty acids then these are omissions means they these have been deleted like general chapter 2.8.3 assay of human antibody immunoglobulin methods b and c have been deleted then in monographs you can see here omitted with ipcs notice dated march 10 2021 lorcaserin hydrochloride hemihydrate and lorcaserin hydrochloride tablets these two have been deleted so these were some of the important salient features of indian pharmacopoeia 2022 so stay connected with us we will be coming with many more new videos thank you so much